the best places for you to meet women. Now, one thing about this is massively misunderstood and that is that there is like one magical place where you can actually meet women and as long as you go to this one magical place, you're gonna meet all the best women in the world and so on and so on. What is actually more important is that you understand the right places for you to meet women because if you're not going to the right places for the kind of women that you wanna look, look for and attract, then you're actually gonna be attracting the wrong women. It doesn't matter how awesome you are or how many times you go to this place that someone else might say is the best place to meet women, that you're not actually gonna get the success you want because you're not gonna find the women that you want for you. So it's really important that you figure out the right place for you to meet women so that you can go to that place and get all the beautiful girls that you wanna meet and then have the best possible chance of finding the right girl for you. Ben Alexander here from the Legends Academy helping men with confidence, dating and relationships and financial freedom. And what I'm talking about today is the best places for guys to meet women. Now, what is what we just talked about is that if you don't go to the right place for you to meet women, then it doesn't matter how many times you go to this place, it might just be that those aren't the right kind of girls for you. So, how do we go about this then? Well, women are very uh, interesting creatures and there's all different types of them. There is no like one characteristic of women and they actually like, firstly, to try lots of different places, depending on the occasion, but also, they often have different sort of specific places that they frequent depending on the type of girl they are. So if you are the sort of guy that has a certain taste in women, you like a certain type of woman, then you need to be almost fishing in the pond as it were, where that kind of fish hangs out. You know, if you, if you go fishing and you, you know, you're looking for um, a salmon, you need to go to like a stream where a salmon is at the time when a salmon's gonna be there. Or if you're looking for like a, a deep ocean fish, like a marlin or something like that, you need to go deep out in the ocean and find that marlin where it actually is in the ocean. So it's the same with women. Women have certain places that they like to go and if you wanna find those type of women, you need to go to that place. So let's look at an example of this. Um, let's say we had a girl who's like a particularly arty kind of girl and she likes sort of more sort of trendy things like that. So if you're a guy who likes those kind of girls, you need to put yourself in the environment or the pond as it were, where that, that fish is, all right? So yeah, there are plenty of fish in the sea, but you gotta go to the right part of the sea to find the right fish that you want. So if you want an arty chick and she does arty stuff, you need to go to like different art events. You need to go to different sort of uh, festivals and cultural events and things like that. You know, massively stereotyping here, but generally that's gonna be where you're gonna find that kind of girl. If you want a more sporty girl, then you need to go along to events where sporty girls hang out. Like where is a sporty girl likely to hang out? She's likely to hang out somewhere where you can get healthy food. She's likely to hang out somewhere where she can actually do sport. She's likely to hang out, you know, different, you know, different places where that kind of girl would hang out. If you want a girl who's like a more party girl, like maybe you love to party and you just want a girl that you can go out to the nightclub with all the time and party, then generally that's gonna be where you're gonna find that kind of girl. So you need to get yourself into the parties and so on and so on. The other thing that's really important to consider is not all girls are always at these places all the time. So you could go to a, a market or whatever, like a farmer's market because you want to meet a healthy chick or a sort of hipster kind of chick or something like that, maybe that's your thing, and you head along to the farmer's market. She's not always going to be there. Like sometimes it could be her friend's birthday party or a hen's night or something like that, and she might be out with all the girls that typically go out to like a nightclub or a bar or something like that. So you need to consider all of these things when you're thinking about the best places for you to meet the kind of women that you want, but generally you can sort of uh, be a bit more specific and figure out where it is that the kind of girls you want are gonna hang out based on their personality type and based on the qualities of the girl that you like yourself. Now what I would also say, because girls aren't always in the same place at the same time, or you may not even have an idea of exactly the type of girl that you wanna have, then you actually need to get yourself along to a variety of different places and go and meet a bunch of different girls there because then you're gonna get used to the type of girl that does actually hang out there, and then you can sort of get a bit more of a clear idea of like, okay, do I like these kind of girls? You know, what sort of girls does this venue generally attract? Am I likely to find the kind of girl that I like in this place? Now, a lot of guys, um, one of the biggest things I see guys doing is they say, oh, but you know, I don't like going to bars, or I don't like loud bars, or I don't like loud nightclubs, and blah, 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 like all these reasons as to why, oh, I'm scared of the nightclub, and I just don't wanna go there, just tell me any other way I can meet girls, Tell me just how to meet girls in the day. I just want to do day game. You know, tell me this and blah, blah, blah. Any excuse so I can just not go to the nightclub and meet beautiful girls there because I'm scared of the music and I'm scared of the guys there and I'm scared of everything. And they find every excuse they can to not go to a nightclub. Now, as much as you may not like to hear this, nightclubs are absolutely brilliant in terms of a place to meet beautiful women because there are so many girls there and they all go there at the same time. So if you're just walking around in the daytime, for example, maybe you go down the shopping mall or something like that, shopping center, and you're walking around trying to find a girl there, 
you could walk around for maybe an hour and there could be like no girls that are suitable, no girls, this type of girl that you like there, blah, 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 blah. So it's really important that you actually, um, if you go to somewhere like a nightclub, you know there's going to be maybe a hundred, you know, depending on the size of the nightclub, you know, 50, 100, 200, 500 girls there that are in kind of like the age bracket maybe you're looking for that are um, likely to be a sort of girl that you're interested in. Like among 500 girls, just because she's at a nightclub doesn't mean she's the sort of girl that always goes to the nightclub. So a lot of girls I've met in nightclubs that ended up being girlfriends of mine, it, it turned out that they were just there for the night. They don't usually go to somewhere like that and they were just there because it was their friend's birthday or maybe it was the only place that was open late and the girls wanted to you know, go out a bit later that night or something like that. So there's a million different reasons as to why girls might be in different places like that. So what are the big takeaways here? The big takeaways are the best places to meet women aren't necessarily what you might think they were. The next thing you need to take away is you need to go to a certain place that is likely to have the kind of girl that you're looking to meet there. That's going to help you find the right kind of girl you want. Also, three, understand that there's not always going to be um, a specific type of girl in a specific type of place at a specific type of, type of time. So you need to actually go and try a bunch of different places and find out the type of girls there and there's a lot of chance that you'll maybe meet a girl in an unlikely place. Also, there are also, um, you know, at a nightclub, Oftentimes there's girls that aren't always at the nightclub at the nightclub. And if you're just making excuses to not go there, it's the easiest place to meet a lot of women um, over a short period of time just because they're all there, they're out to socialize, they're out to have a good time, they're out to meet other people, generally they're open-minded to that. So definitely get yourself into environments where there are a lot of women and a nightclub is a brilliant place for that. You don't have to go to one that has like thumping loud music. Even amongst nightclubs, guys, there's still like a bunch of different kind of bars or chill venues or like more classy venues, you know, one of my favorite places to go to meet women are the more sort of upmarket little sort of smaller bars, you know, the cocktail bars, stuff like that. Generally, you get a different sort of caliber of women in those places. I am stereotyping, but yeah, just in my experience, that's what I've found because those women specifically are avoiding like the more sort of mainstream carnage that you might find in say uh, a more general audience nightclub and not a high-end nightclub. So yeah, I hope this has been helpful for you. Um, I want you to comment below, like put some comments in and let me know where your favorite places are to meet girls. What's the type of girl that you like and where have you found is the best place to meet her? Help a brother out, post a comment below, let the other guys know where you found to be a good place for you to meet the kind of girls you want. Also, if you love this video and you think it might help a brother or a friend of yours, um, share it with him. Send him, send him this video, help him out. Um, also, you can check us out if you want more of these videos, you want more blogs, you want more articles, you want free trainings, you can check us out on legendsacademy.com.au. So head over to legendsacademy.com.au and check us out there. Remember to subscribe on YouTube if you're watching us on YouTube. Remember to follow us on Twitter. We are at Academy Legends. You can also get us on Periscope where you're likely watching this now as well. Um, there's so many ways to reach us. We hope we can keep helping you and serving you. And the biggest thing to remember is to stay legendary out there and I will see you in the next video.